anything about it. Well, you're Joel Embiid, and you have about 48 hours to consider the fact that you went scoreless for the first time ever, not only in an NBA game, but he never did it in his college wow. career. His one year at Kansas. Light on their mind. Sixers bust out of the locker room, hitting four of their first six. There's Heald. you got to stay with him. He misses the three. JoJo's got to be content with that. He gets the double team guy, sits in his lap. He has to kick it out. He has to hope and trust that his teammates will make those shots. NBA to the 321 straight for Utah's Joe Ingles. Nice play by Simmons to get it to Richardson, but he missed the three. And after the hot start, the Sixers have cooled. Missing nine of the previous ten. But he healed again the career high four in just 26 minutes against his former team, the Miami Heat. Healed, got it done. That was for three for Buddy Healed. I'm airballing the three. Here come the Kings. It's a 10.6er lead here in the first. Only 2% of the armed service population serve in the armed service. It's nice to acknowledge them. Nice hook by Horford, always the good passer, averaging four assists per game, and Ben Simmons getting the easy deuce inside. Al created that play on the penetration. Healed, escaping, and Scott, and now in beat on control against Barnes. Well, play continues. Healed working over Richardson. That, you know what, that's really good defense. You take your hat off to Buddy Healed. Last December, get a three-pointer at the buzzer. And a comeback win against the Lakers. Sixers not switching anything on defense, keeping everyone honest. Bogdan Bogdanovich, not related to Boyan Bogdanovich, now the Utah Jazz. Mike Scott. How about glad you're not here? How do you say that in Croatian? <laughs> Building worthy of wearing 88 was Lindros back in the day, right? And that number's retired. That's what I'm saying. Doesn't even look good on him. Still getting used to Luca wearing 77. That's a funky number. I was watching them last night. Right. And Simmons back into the contest. Sets up a Horford three. For the Sixers, one of ten from beyond, and the Kings one for nine. Bielitsa stripped on the play. Harris on the case. Simmons the loose ball. Brought it down. Thank you. What do we always say? You don't bring it. Kings with a 7-9 and nine record. 3-6 and six on the road. Again tonight they are ending a four-game Eastern Snowman. Yeah. Bagley tough one overcome. They've been struggling all year. Joseph behind the back of the Sixers, and that's a good timeout by one of two for Embiid. The double double already, and 11 points and 10 boards. As healed, that was a deep two, and hustling that down. He was in the corner initially, but they overplayed, and he kind of just lost. The defender lost him. So Josh, with the smart, instinctive backdoor cut, Deadman buries. Here in the third. I still believe that you can send Sacramento a message that this is not their night, and I think that they'll capitulate, but you got to bring it. Simmons again. As you can see Luke Walton trying to get his guys to just calm down and execute. Frustrating when you can't even get into your sets. But he healed. Change and look offensively, they thought they got good looks, but when you're shooting 10% from three, you just gotta have some shots fall. Serena mentioning offensive rebounds. The Sixers come in as the best dismissing. Not sure what the deal is involving Josh Richardson. Not sure you can see him on the bench at this particular time from our vantage point. Meantime, Heald with a dazzling move, but he missed the three. It's a close out and challenge from Heald. Got a hand up on that Furcon attempt. King starting the quarter. Well, with that make, two of eight, and son of the Hall of Famer, Bill. Yep. By the way, the Sixers, uh, nicely done by Thibel, getting rewarded here. His time, double team didn't come. Nice, decisive move from Tobias. Thibel all over heel. He took it away from him again. Dribbles it to third. Looking for Tobias. 
steal by Bogdanovich. Healed for a three. Three points in the third quarter for the home team. A category that was six to four with only a two point margin. Wow. Well, the bad news is Matisse thought he's passed to Kirkmaz. One more for a Scott three. Boy, and Beach shoved out of the way to the floor. The whistle's silent. Kings will try to take advantage, and they will. As Bielitsa deposits two. Hey. Sixers, their largest lead at 16. Force in middle, no baseline. Oh, Matisse Thibel, another block on heel. That's the second time he snuffed them in the game. Heel again, determined to get his, and he drops the deep deuce. Surgical with it. Before, he just needed volume shots. Now, much better. Well, guess what? He's a volume shooter tonight. He's got his 20 points on 22 shots. Ooh. 8 of 22 for the floor. And Fievel took it away from him, and he has gone a solo. Wow! What a game for Matisse Thibel. This field. Why the 76ers traded for him on draft night. Deadman off the Bielitsa miss. Healed. Missing the three. Fled at the play. Kings, you need something quick. Good show. Rolling in, Deadman is Embiid went after the good shooter. Not need to stop from a sixer perspective. Don't you be the one stopping it. Just pull it back out. Heel gliding in, gets two.